Are you tired of dirty, bland, and uninspiring backgrounds in your videos? Are you tired of dirty, bland, and uninspiring backgrounds in your videos? The most common reasons why so many brilliant and creative minds out there are yet to share their ideas or content with the world is simply because of their poor video backgrounds or dirty environments. Whether you are an aspiring content creator or someone who is simply interested in refining his or her video editing skills, you've come to the right place. Today's tutorial is all about changing your video background and it's not just about changing your backgrounds, you have to make it look both realistic and believable. And the best part is that it is totally free with the help of these two apps, Canva and my personal favorite, CapCut. For every video that you want to change the background, there are rules that you must follow. First things first, ensure that you have a clear background. What I mean is the background should not be too busy. Get a plain background that the colors are not fighting each other. Secondly, your outfit, the color of your outfit should differ from the color of the wall because this will make it easier to replace the background later. Thirdly, ensure that there are no shadows behind you because when you have shadows behind you, it affects your face. I've divided this video into three easy steps. Step one, setting up your filming space. Ensure you have good lighting and a clear uncluttered background behind you. This will make it easier to replace the background later. Step two, choosing your background image. When choosing a background image or video that you would like to use as a background in any video, ensure that the video or image is appropriate for the context of your video. This background, for instance, is a no-no. Now this is what a good makeup video background should look like. And this brings us to our third and final step, editing your videos. Open the CapCut app, tap on expand, tap on text to image. This is what your home screen would look like. Go to showcase. Under trends, they have so many beautiful and amazing pictures. Now, under realistic, the images are so real that you would hardly tell that they were generated with AI. But to generate our background image, we we'll go to designs. The images under designs are my personal favorites because the aesthetics and the lighting are so top notch. I, sometimes I feel like the images speak to you, like they convey their own stories. So you go through the app, choose whichever image best suits your video. If you're wondering how I generated my background videos, kindly note that this is a step-by-step -step tutorial. So endeavor to watch this video to the end so you don't miss anything. To create your own image, go back to create, tap on the picture icon, choose your preferred picture. I have chosen an object because I want it to focus on the TV set, set it at 100 accuracy, and then you go to add. Now for the description, what I have written here is a beautifully decorated living room with white walls, a table, bookshelf, good lighting, and a TV set. Here's the images that has been generated. Here's a close-up look. I like this one. Yeah, I like this one also, but I think I prefer this. So go back, tap on upscale. It gives you the image in HD quality. Tap on save and that's it. Now let's head over to Canva. Tap on the plus icon. In your search bar, just simply write YouTube thumbnail. Choose the first one. Here is what it looks like. These are some of the generated thumbnails. Some are free and some you would have to pay for. To generate your tap on camera roll. Choose the image you just created from CapCut. You can zoom the image to fill the entire canvas but the best method would be to click on these three dots close to the delete icon. Tap on this set image as and automatically it will fill the entire space without you having to lift a finger and it locks it automatically. To add a little flare to this image, tap on elements, go to the search bar, type in YouTube icons. They have so many beautiful icons, but because we are sticking to free, please kindly pick anyone that doesn't have the word pro attached to it. You know what I mean? So here's the elements that I have chosen. Tap on any of the white dots around it to resize it and then place it wherever you prefer. This step now is totally optional. Some might like it and some might not. So just do whatever works for you, yeah? Please don't be in a hurry. Take your time till you achieve your desired result. Well, I think it's okay like this. So let's go to download. Tap on this icon here. Tap on download. Tap on download. 
and your image is downloading please don't turn off your device or exit the app while the image is downloading tap on new import select the image we just got from canva resize it until you get your preferred length or rather the length of the video you'd like to edit and when you're done with this tap on the plus icon here and add a brand new video now the reason why i am editing this video like this is because so many people find it difficult to overlay their videos directly so i think placing it on the main track makes it easier tap on the video select overlay then adjust it to you get the length exact length of the image then go to remove background tap on remove background auto removal and that's it use your fingers to zoom or minimize the video and place it wherever you want within the frame split the video as much as possible because when you fail to split it you notice that when you download the video it um it freezes that's what my younger brother calls pause and play <laughs> so try as much as possible to split the videos yeah to make this background look more realistic let's go to effects tap on video effects on the search bar simply write b l u r blur select the first one and that's it let's go to adjust you can reduce it or increase it but i prefer seven here's what my video looks like now tap on filters there is no law anywhere in the world that says you can only use one filter per video choose as many filters as you want so long as it doesn't make you have two heads in your videos and it looks good on you then you're good to go adjust the intensity of your filters and that's it click on this arrow at the top right side and download your video please like this video if you haven't done so already hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so that you will never miss a tutorial whenever i post a brand new video i would love to hear your thoughts and questions in the comment section open the pixel app if you don't have it kindly download it after watching this video it's very important and necessary this app offers you free background videos in hd quality hd <laughs> One of the things that I really love about this app is that you don't need to create an account with them before you'll be able to download videos, but I recommend you create an account with them just to be on the safe side. The beautiful video of a young lady applying makeup that I used earlier on in this tutorial video to enlighten us on the importance of using a background image that is appropriate for the context of our videos I got from here. I really like this video so i will download it now then take you back to the home page to show you how to create your own videos tap on this arrow here download video hd quality download video it's preparing to download once it's completely downloaded you'll find it in your photo gallery or wherever you watch your videos from so that's it it's very simple please if you're buoyant enough kindly donate to the artist who created the video or image that you're downloading because that's the only way you can repay them like i said before the app is free to use now let's go back to the home screen in the search bar type in whichever background you would like to see for me i'm searching for museums tap on videos the videos here are really beautiful and sophisticated that's why i love them so much Endeavor to find out the recommended aspect ratio for any platform that you intend to post your videos, just like YouTube is 16 by 9. I don't really know the aspect ratio for Instagram and TikTok videos, but I do know that TikTok videos are the long form videos like this ones, exactly like this, and Instagram are square, while YouTube are rectangular videos like this ones. No matter your niche or your content idea, there is always a video for you. Even if you're not looking for background videos, you can always get videos to help add a little flair to your videos or to further buttress your point across to your audience. For instance, someone who is into relationship talks, you could download videos about couples who are dancing, happy couples, couples fighting, so on and so forth. 
Import your main video and the video you would like to use as your background video. Then overlay your main video just like we did with the image tutorial video. Resize it until you get the appropriate size or length that you want. This is me doing the finishing touches. The video that I'm currently editing now is a pre-edited video. So what I'm doing is splitting and deleting all the parts where I have artificially generated backgrounds. And what I really need is the plain background. Tap on remove BG, auto removal. Now here's the before and after videos. Are you tired of dirty, bland and uninspiring backgrounds in your videos? Are you tired of dirty, bland and uninspiring backgrounds in your videos? Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't be afraid to experiment with different backgrounds and editing techniques until you find what best works for you. Thank you for watching this video to the end and until I come your way again, the pleasure is mine now and always. Watch the trailer. Are you a chef or someone who simply loves to cook, a motivational speaker, a comedian, or you could even be an upcoming or a pro makeup artist, whatever your niche is, my next tutorial video is a detailed step-by-step -step guide on how to create clickable, engaging and fascinating thumbnails for all your different content ideas and the best part is that it's totally free. Kindly hit the subscribe button and tap on the bell icon so that you'll be among the first persons to get notified once this video drops. Trust me, you don't want to miss it. Love you.